All right, everybody. So today we're bringing you a real special episode. We're going to be looking inside Coach 1283. 1283 is being used for the calendar shoot. We're actually going to do an Easter shoot today, a photo shoot for the calendar for 2019. And the marketing team is inside right now. You can hear production going on behind me, but inside the coach, Pete Sutton is shooting photos. So what they do for the calendar, when the coach is done, and 1283, which is an H3 double slide, just got done. Before it is decored by Al and Brenda from our design team, before they go in and do all the decor, Pete Sutton, Sarah, Mickey from marketing, they all get in there and they design it for Easter. They set it up for the April 2019 calendar shoot. So they've got all this decor out here. And one of the coolest things I want to show you is they actually used real bunnies. They used live bunnies today. And as you can see, come here babies. I was gonna pick him up to show you guys, but look how look how peaceful and calm they're sleeping. We're gonna leave him alone. Because while I'm sleeping, I don't want someone picking me up. So anyway, lots of decor is used, themed in that Easter uh, concept that uh, Pete Sutton has. And so a lot of this is being used. What they're gonna do is, they're gonna go in, set it up for an Easter photo shoot, shoot the photos, take it all out and archive it. And then our decor team, our designers are gonna go in and set up the coach with all its regular decor because this coach is actually gonna be for sale within the next couple days. So let's go inside and see, uh, see what Pete's doing right now. All right, everybody, so here we are in coach number 1283. And this is just going to be a teaser because we don't want to show everything about this Easter calendar shoot decor. Uh, we want to save it for when the calendar actually comes out. Uh, a lot of anticipation behind that annual calendar from Marathon. So that calendar comes out. Pete, when does that come out? Uh, it'll hit people at the uh, beginning of December. So at the end of the year, beginning of December, you'll see that calendar. Uh, so we don't want to give away too much of the decor as you see right here. Uh, one of the things that Pete uh, was doing this morning uh, early the was... The whole team. This the, was a whole yeah, group that's a good point. The whole team, including members of Pete's family, were bringing in those live bunnies that you saw. We're bringing in flowers, we're bringing in candies and chocolates. Like I mentioned earlier, Sarah was um, coloring Easter eggs for decor. Um, it all works together to get the end result of beautiful photos for the calendar. Now, in addition, what we did this morning was uh, Pete uh, had set up a whole photo shoot uh, upstairs at Marathon uh, for the bunnies, uh, the live bunnies that you met outside. The Maritime Magazine, which we did the photo shoot for this morning, uh, you had Todd in that photo, you had Sarah in that photo, and myself. Uh, for an article in the magazine about Marathon Mondays, which is really cool. Uh, Mickey, our assistant director of marketing, came up with the idea to do this article on Marathon Mondays in the Maritime Magazine, and so we were doing a photo shoot for that. Maritime Magazine, if you don't know, is a 100% in-house creation uh, that our marketing team works on throughout the year, and um, they've got several issues that come out uh, throughout the year. And it's a really good magazine. It's not just about Marathon Coach, but about the entire environment and uh, how would you describe it, Pete? Its main focus is the club. Uh, Marathon Coach has an actual club you can join. And these in this, twice a year, they go out to rallies. 
It's usually for a week at a time. It's a lot of fun. Everybody gets together. Uh, everybody's treated real well, but you get there's fun activities. You get to see places you haven't seen. So it's about the lifestyle. Uh, in particular, the club, but we go beyond that. This, this article has not only stories about Mal, and sometimes it's about a coach or a particular function of a coach, but in this case, it's also about the, the NASCAR rally that we held. And that one wasn't club, that was the, the actual Marathon Corporation. And that was really fun. That was the four days out at the Las Vegas Speedway, got to meet famous people, see the cars, see the races. It was a ball. And, you know, uh, while we're on that, I wanted to ask you a few questions about the NASCAR um, relationship that Marathon has. That's a long-standing relationship that Marathon has had with NASCAR. That's correct. So, um, we, you know, for a lot of people, we see a lot of Prevo chassis on the uh, track at every weekend of a NASCAR race. And what a lot of people don't realize is that over the years, over the decades, a lot of those have been marathons. That's correct. Yeah. So, uh, Marathon has always had, I know our owners uh, and a lot of employees, they love. Um, NASCAR and so um, we have a really good relationship with a lot of drivers so that's a really neat thing yeah it is it's a lot of fun it, it is I found this was the first time I'd been to the Las Vegas Speedway uh, this last few weeks and it was kind of fun to be out there and you start picking your drivers and you know you know which ones are marathoners and you know some of them like you know like Chase who just had his delivered and you know I got to do his paint job so I was very excited about it so I found myself favoring Chase Elliott real quick. For sure. Yeah. So how could you not? How could you not? Yeah, I mean you 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 were so integral on getting his coach ready for him. Um yeah, I mean I myself I I'm not a big NASCAR fan, but since coming to Marathon and um getting to be around the whole thing with his coach, uh he's a he's a guy I look for now. Yep. You know and how he's how he's doing. Um, so anyway, let's while we're here, let's ask Pete a few questions about um, the calendar shoot. We have actually on Marathon Mondays talked to you before about the calendar shoot. We know how important it is as a tool, not just for marketing, but people really anticipate the calendar every year. Mm -hmm. And you go to a lot of time and effort and thought behind these themed calendar months. Uh, without giving anything away, tell us about what you're doing. All right. Well, well, the first thing that everybody should know is this really does stem from Steve Shellhorn, the owner. I mean, this is very important to him. He, uh, he gives us a lot of leeway on this because he wants it to be the best. Right. And in a way, the calendar is almost like our corporate brochure mm -hmm. because it has the best pictures. There's a ton of effort put on it. They're not cheap to create. Right. And Steve sees every page, every detail, he and I work these things over uh, to the nth degree. And uh, this year, Sarah has been also a photographer on this. So between the two of us, uh, we'll be hitting this. Steve has asked for uh, this year, instead of two holidays, we're doing three oh, holiday wow. shoots, which Have is fun. Have you decided what those are? For sure, Christmas, Easter, and we're starting to think the 4th of July. Oh, very cool. Um, Steve picks them personally. Okay. And from there, the the coaches we put the decor in are more about opportunity. I mean, if there's a coach there and we've got it for a couple of days, we take it. And sometimes, sure. hey, it would, would it have been better to put Easter in a lighter coach? Yeah but I don't always get that flexibility, but it's it's a lot of fun, it's a lot of work, more work than people think. It's about yeah. a three day process to decorate a coach, photograph it, take it all back out, clean it. Um, it's always, of course, brand spanking new. Uh, usually the coach is one or two days old when we do the shoot. Right. Um, so it very important piece to us. Uh, we'll get all these pictures back, we'll sit on them for a few months, and probably October I'll begin the build process of the calendar and, uh, it's it's a big deal. It takes a long time and a long time to get it printed. And, uh, but and anyway, I, it's I, worth it. I watched you do it last year. And you spent a lot of time and effort and thought. And then you got with, like you mentioned, Steve Shellhorn, our owner, Marathon's owner. And I saw, because this is my first year with Marathon, I really saw how personal this is to Steve. Yeah, it's a not big deal. just to you and Mickey and Sarah and Todd, but 
to Steve is very personal and making minor changes are, uh, you know, in, in Steve's mind the way he wants it to be seen. Uh, that was really neat to see. Yeah. Yeah, it is fun. It's fun to work with him. He's got he's got good ideas, good taste. So, and it's it's also nice when it's a big project like this because he gives us the backing and everything we need to, to do it right. And you know, like I said, this one's done right. Yeah, that's cool. Well, there it is. We don't want to give away too much of the Easter calendar shoot, but um, we really appreciate Pete letting us invade the space because, quite frankly, they're under a time crunch because I mean, hey, we've got live bunnies. We've got the fresh flowers, fresh, fresh fruit. Yeah, fresh flowers and fruit and carrots and bunnies. And this coach needs to be re uh so that it can go up for sale, whether it's going to stay here at the world headquarters in Coburg or head off uh, to another location to either a show, to a party, or to let uh, others uh, go through it and check it out. Anyway, uh, so big thanks to Pete Sutton. Uh, Thanks to Sarah, Mickey, and Todd. Uh, it's been a long day for the marathon marketing team, but quite frankly, it's Friday. This is a pre-taped show, so I want you to know it's been a long week for this marketing team because they've been working on going and finding all of this decor, going shopping, ordering things, making phone calls and making sure all the flowers were right. Uh, Pete's family was here this morning bringing the bunnies in. Uh, bringing in the food for the bunnies uh, really really neat and it all comes together to make April 2019 in the calendar look awesome so really appreciate to uh, appreciate the entire team uh, marketing team letting me invade their space so that I could show you guys uh, kind of one of the major tools here at marathon when it comes to marketing so I know I'm a little wordy but it wouldn't be Mal without a lot of words I'm out of here. Have a good week, everybody, and uh, be yourself and do good things. See ya. Look at that. Okay, here's the deal. Sarah from our marketing team made these eggs. She colored them. She put this little gold finishing on them. Look at that. That's a lot of work. Just took the time to boil these eggs, color these eggs. She plans on eating them. And she does she plan on eating oh, them? Yeah. That's awesome and take a look at this you got hard-boiled eggs on the range as part of the decor how cool is that I wanted to come in here and see what uh, detail the marketing team goes to to get this into the calendar shoot so take a look at that it doesn't get any better than that so this is one of the co-stars of the shoot. Look carrot, honey. Not interested in the carrot. No, no, no. There we go.